guys, happy new year. It's been a minute since we did one of these day in the life videos. I've actually been on vacation for the past few weeks. We went to Florida, Michigan, New York, Chicago, uh, just to see some family. Today's one of my first few days back at work. So I have a lot of catching up to do, as you can tell. So I have a check-in with the data team this morning, and then I have a few meetings with the supply and product team about some potential projects that we might be working on. And then at lunchtime, we're gonna go see an apartment. Uh, and then later today in the evening, I have a machine learning check-in with my mentors. But also I'll be interviewing a data engineering candidate later today, so stay tuned for that. For those of you who don't know me, hello, welcome. My name is Ranesh. I'm currently working as a data analyst for a startup, but most of the work I've been doing has been geared towards machine learning, you know, predictive modeling, causal inference, stuff like that. And I've also been the interim data engineer while we've been on the search to look for a new one. I'm slowly working to increase the skills that I have to pivot into a more machine learning or data science role. So I appreciate all the training and mentorship I've gotten from this company. Oh, also my brother's flying in later tonight from Malaysia, so we'll get to see him too later today. All right, without further ado, I have that check in to join right now. So let's get to that meeting real quick. All right, we just got done with the check-in. This one was slightly longer than usual because we all just got back from vacation, so we had a lot of catching up to do. I have a lot of personal stuff to get done today, so I wanna get my work done as soon as possible, so let's get right to that. All right, so we got the majority of my work done, and then we have that apartment tour scheduled for like right now, so I'm gonna go get ready, uh, maybe even grab some lunch after, maybe even work out. Uh, but yeah, we have a lot of meetings later today in the evening, so I'll be sure to check you guys in later on. wanted to change an environment so we went to the library for the rest of today's workday all right so we just got to the library and i have a machine learning check-in meeting in like a couple minutes so we have to rush to the floor that we're going to be sitting at uh basically i'm just going to be talking about some of the projects i've done you know we've been uh, looking at different tools to enhance our machine learning operations at the company one of the tools is aws SageMaker, so i've been testing out some of the pre-trained models there building my own you know messing around with s3 buckets endpoints uh, stuff like that just to get the full understanding of how SageMaker works and you know what we can use it for so yeah i'm going to be talking about that to the director of data science and our bi manager just to give them a short breakdown of what i've been doing and what we can do with this tool and then uh, hopefully you know hire more data scientists to maximize our machine learning capabilities at dispatch i also have a meeting uh, later on where we'll be interviewing a data engineer candidate it's a panel interview with all the data team members so uh, we'll see uh, we're looking to hire a new data engineer since our old one left but yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. That meeting's kind of late, so I don't know if I'll check back in after or you know maybe give you a short recap uh, the next day. But yeah, stay tuned and I'll, I'll close the video out when I can. Meeting in a few minutes to talk about some of the machine learning projects I've done for different departments. I'm currently training a model with SageMaker on Amazon Web Services Studio. Uh, I'm gonna mess around with their pre-trained models to see if there's any use case for a company. I also built a few apps on this notebook service. It's called hex.tech which allows the usage of you know, SQL, Python, and R on the same notebook, which I think is pretty cool. These days, I tend to start my machine learning projects there instead of on a Jupyter notebook on my own VS Code, uh, just because it's more convenient. I can use multiple languages. Uh, I can connect directly to our warehouse and pull data right from there. And I can also deploy high-level apps for certain teams or departments to use uh, if it's not necessarily too complex and I don't need to move it into SageMaker. Anyway, I have this machine learning check-in in a couple minutes, but I'll bring you along, I'll keep you updated, and I have an interview later uh, that I'll try to bring you guys along too. It's uh, a bit late, so we'll see. Also, I haven't updated my resume in a while, so I was curious to see if you guys want you know, to see a video of me uh, redoing or modifying my resume uh, to test and see if it's gonna pass an ATS scan. So yeah, let me know down below if you guys are interested in a video like that. Uh, I'm curious to hear your thoughts and you know, maybe your interest in what videos you guys wanna see uh, in the future. check-in went well. I had a couple new ideas on what projects I want to work on, but I'll fill you guys in later. I have another meeting now. I'm interviewing a candidate for uh, the data engineer position we have open in our company, so I'll have to get to that. I'll talk to you guys after. All 
All right, so it's about 6 p.m. right now. I just got done with my last meeting. If you can't tell, I'm pretty exhausted. I've been on a vacation for about two to three weeks. I'm starting to get back to the pace of my startup, so it's taking me some time. I'm slowly getting back into it. Also, for those of you who don't know, we are currently hiring three different positions within my data team. I did a scientist, a data engineer, and also a data analyst intern. Two of those positions are senior level positions, but the other position, the data analyst intern, will be working directly under me. I've been interviewing quite a number of candidates uh, these past few months, and I made a video talking about seven things I learned from interviewing these candidates. So if you guys are interested on some interview tips, feel free to check that out. I think we're going to go grab dinner real quick and then maybe take a nap before I have to go to the airport. Anyway, I'll try to bring you guys along, but it is getting pretty late, so we'll see. Uh, catch you guys back later. Hey guys, so it's the next day and I'm going to close the clip. Uh, basically, my brother's flight got delayed yesterday, so we got back home pretty late and I didn't feel like uh, recording a clip, so I decided to push it to today. Uh, everything's good. Uh, all my work's done and we have a presentation this week talking about some of the work that I did last week, uh, some of the machine learning projects that I've been working on, the SageMaker model I've been training. So that's pretty cool. I'll try and make a video talking about that in the future. But anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, feel free to leave them down below. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, feel free to leave a like down below if you enjoyed the video.